What's going on YouTube? This is the Anime Dipper back from his vacation. I know I uploaded a video about two days ago uh, from today on how to build Zangetsu, uh, the second state of uh, Ichigo Kurosaki's uh, Zanpakuto from Bleach. So if y'all guys haven't checked that out, make sure you go on my channel and freaking check it out or I'll link it in the description below, whatever's easier for y'all. But today I've got a topic that a lot of people have been talking about. But, um, I'm going to make it to where I'm going to be saying it and probably make a little bit more sense about it. And first, I'm going to be throwing in a dip like I always do. If y'all guys are loyal fans, y'all have seen it before. I'm going to be throwing in my personal favorite dip, Coco Nuggets of the Blend. So let's pack, pack. First one wasn't good. Yeah, And today's topic is going to be on the character creation on the next Xenoverse game. Now, everyone said, okay, we need a lot more character options for creative characters in the next game. Oh, we need more colors, we need more costumes, we need all that. But what about the races, you guys? That's what I'm concerned about. Because you could deck out freaking uh, an Akrosian to look like a fusion cell. Or freaking make a human look like a freaking King Kai. Or even make a fat boo look like Android 19. But why create them when they could already have them in there and have their own special abilities? And I'm going to freaking be explaining what I think is the right way to do this. Also, I put this, I put that same question up on the Anime Multiverse website, the Dragon Ball Super website, and Thundershot69 website. I'm going to link all of them in the description below as well, like I always do, because those guys are awesome. And freaking, if I'm forgetting anything, people have actually commented on some of my freaking uh, videos, not on my videos, but on the questions themselves, on the websites, and I'm going to post uh, all three of them right here. I appreciate y'all guys freaking uh, commenting, leaving suggestions for me, and especially that one guy who said, I can't wait for this video to go up. I love the support, man. Thanks. And, and enough of me talking. Y'all want to see what I actually think. Let's throw the Xenoverse gameplay up, and let's see what I actually think. So, as usual, let's go right into it. Alright you guys, so this is what I meant by uh, different races. As you see, I've got a regular Saiyan, a male freaking human, that, a freaking Arcogian, a Namek, a freaking Boo. And these two I just kind of made myself. This is the Android, and this is the Kai. So freaking, I'm going to go ahead and delete one of these characters. I'm just delete the Boo chick. And freaking show you their abilities just in case you're not aware of what they are. Alright, so you got the Majin's uh, high defense and slow in recovery. Defense bonus when stamina is at max, blah blah blah. Females have higher movement speed with the Majin's. Alright, then you got the Saiyans. Freaking males have stronger melee attack and buffs for, long, for longer lasting and super moves aren't as strong. Females have Z assist more frequently, better key and stamina recovery, but low health. Alright, and then, uh, freaking males have stronger strike attacks, and females have stronger key blasts, and they also recharge their key automatically very slowly, if y'all guys didn't know that. These guys have low attack, but their health regenerates freaking really fast. I don't know why it did that. And then they have fast movement speed, but low attack can paralyze enemies with their key blast and a speed bonus when their HP is low. I really don't like this race. But I'm also freaking thinking, why not add a freaking android race as well as a freaking uh, Kai race as well, like I have with my other two characters right here. Alright you guys, and we're going to be starting off with the androids here. Um, what I believe, there should be two types of androids. Uh, instead of being like a male 
well, there should be a male and a female android, but there should also be a cell type of android. Well, because cell is technically a freaking uh, android, but we'll start off with the uh, android 17 and 18 type androids. <coughs> what they should have is a special ability where instead of bounce, instead of bouncing off the key blast, they should be able to absorb them instead of being able to knock them off, as well as have like a small percentage of. Uh, being able to knock off a super attack and uh, if they snap vanish uh, freaking just at the right time I know that sounds kinda weird but that's pretty much what I've been thinking about and they should also have a small percentage of being able to uh, regenerate key just like the the, uh, the humans do but just make it go a little bit slower and be able to absorb key blasts as well. And now with the cells, uh, androids, they should uh, regenerate health just like the Namex if their health gets too low. But also, uh, if they use drain attacks like uh, Super Drain or Hyper Drain or whatever the hell it's called, and they should be able to get just a little bit more uh, key and stamina from the opponent than uh, what a regular person using uh, the drain abilities would do. As well as freaking, uh, I'll be explaining it in another video, but if they transform, they'll be able to gain a little bit more power. Now let's uh, cut it from here and freaking go to the Kai's. Now the Kai's are gonna be a little bit more complicated. I haven't had a lot of time to think about it, but the Kai's should be able to have a little bit more, uh, um, what's the fuck's to call? Uh, a little bit more key than uh, regular uh, people. Like instead of having three key bars like I have here with the uh, Kai Chick right here, uh, they should start out with four because Kai Chick's only level one right now. They should start out with four, but their stamina should be about probably two and a half, maybe three. I'd say start out with three. And they should also have a little bit more movement speed, depending on the size that they are. Um, what I've really thought about is uh, breaking it down into two different uh, Kai's, like male and female Kai's. But instead of having a short female and a tall male, you, sh you should be able to do either one. And freaking be able to, uh, what's the fuck's it called? Um, Different between the two. Like, if you want a tall Kai that's a little bit more beefy, they should have a, a better fighting, uh, a better melee, as well as uh, strike supers, as well as a little bit more stamina. But if they're a short Kai, they should have more movement speed, as well as a freaking, uh, a little bit more uh, key, but also lose just a little bit more health, as well as having a. Uh, slight advantage with the uh, key blast, just like the Saiyan uh, females do. But I mean, just change it up. And once they get their uh, potential unlocked, because that's what I think their uh, transformation would be, that would uh, probably, I'd say, raise it up by a fourth. And if they want to, they could also include the Patara earrings as well to. Uh, fusion because you need to have the Batara earrings to do the Batara fusion of course that also goes back to my fusion video and freaking if you're just happen to walk on to another Kai and you're freaking uh, say hey you want two Kais freaking alright I'll have two Kais and they can fuse together and create one freaking more powerful Kai and freaking you'd be able to use a Dragon Ball wish to uh separate them later on if you want to but I wouldn't I would just keep them in uh, one freaking thing but these are only two characters I really want to think about some more characters to add on to the created pool um, let me guys know what you think uh, should happen and I'll kick it right back to me uh, right now so y'all guys can uh, get this video finished I appreciate it so that's what I think you guys I hope you guys enjoyed it and freaking like always leave a like in the Leave a like and a little like button down there if you enjoyed it. If not, I'll try and make it better for the next video. Leave a comment in the description box below, and not in the description box, in the comment section below. If y'all guys want any kind of uh, cosplay builds done, suggestions, 
for videos, uh, for freaking duels, for any kind of video game. If y'all want to see coming up in the future, go ahead and leave those in the comments below because I'm going to be getting a couple more games within the next uh, month or so. I'm also going to be throwing up uh, some prototype videos because I had a Bumbleback come out uh, not too long ago. Thundershot's already been playing it, so if y'all guys rather see him play it, I'll freaking link those down in the description below to where y'all guys can watch him play it. And I'll just be kind of doing my own thing with the prototype because I love playing that game anyway. But anyway, y'all have heard enough of me talk. Uh, freaking, I appreciate y'all guys watching. And as always, freaking, this is my dip monster. He's always awesome here too. He's my only freak here. Uh, but as always, you guys, it's 2 o'clock here. Freaking, peace out, homies.